Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Metro 8 Gaming, and we're doing something different. Yeah. Hey, I... it's our faces. It's me, Harrison, and this is Colin. What's up, guys? And today, we're going to be doing the Super Couch Fighters, uh, Challenge. The Super Couch Fighters Complete Breakfast Challenge. That's yeah. right. Uh, about a week ago on the Super Couch Fighters channel, they posted a video of Marvel Nemesis where uh, Brett issued a complete breakfast challenge. Uh, basically, the challenge is to eat everything that is in those commercials for a complete breakfast cereal, like on the cereal commercials. And uh, specifically, Brett listed the objects, the items that we would be eating. So, what we have today, we've got the cereal, obviously, with milk. Uh, we're gonna have a glass of orange juice and another glass of milk. We've got two pieces of toast for each of us. We've each got an apple. Uh, the toast is required to have butter. And uh, we've also each got ourselves a hard boiled egg. So, with that out of the way, we're gonna go ahead and get into eating this shit here. None of this is, yeah. None of this is on like a time limit. Ow, just, God damn it! I just pinched my thumb. It's fine. What? <laughs> none of this is on a time limit. None of this is, you know. I mean, uh, there is kind of a time limit, and that time limit is how long will my phone record well before stopping? I mean, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna be getting up, Colin and I are both gonna be getting up periodically just to make sure that we're still recording. Yeah. Part of the challenge is to get it all in one take. So, maybe, okay, go ahead, go heavy on the cereal. Yeah. Just pour me some milk, but See if I care. <laughs> yeah, I don't care. I'm going light. Why, you don't, th you don't, you, you don't think I can like finish all this? I honestly don't. I, I think that it's going to be a little bit more filling than you are prepared for. I am going to smash this like in 10 seconds. And we're just gonna move all the stuff off camera here. That was just for the opening shot, that it yeah. was all pretty and pristine. I just poured milk on the table. Smooth move. That's I just did it again. I'm an idiot, but it's fine. I will get it all cleaned up. This butter does not want to spread. I'm just gonna have chunks of butter on my toast. Oh, and we each also have to have a glass of milk. Oh, yeah. As well as what's in the cereal. <laughs> so Kitty. it's gonna be like... Dogs. Oh, look, 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 yeah. There are dogs in the room, if you can't tell. I have two dogs. One's named Kitty. This is a true fact. Also, these eggs are actually bad. Good thing we're only using it for <laughs> display then. Uh, I will take my apple. Okay. I'm gonna pour some orange juice. Give me your glass. Other glass. <laughs> No, I want both orange juice and milk in the same glass, because I'm disgusting. Because apparently, eating, or I guess, uh, drinking uh, orange juice with pulp in it is wrong. It's not wrong, it's just, why would you do it? Because I like to chew when I drink my orange that juice. That makes no sense! I like that- Who chews when they drink? I mean, if you drink, like, like if you, like, have a cup of soup or something. I'm gonna get myself a dab of butter here for my toast. A what of butter? A dab. You're a dumbass. You know that? Yeah. Hey, into the eating I go. I've been delaying yeah. it long enough. We got, yeah, some, this is pretty, uh, <laughs> this is a breakfast. I mean, it is what it is. What music do you think I should put under this? Oh, uh, some like elevator, like some like like a bossa nova. Sure. No, just really dramatic, like f like final boss fight and um like music. No man, let's keep it light. Let's do a bossa nova. Okay. Future Harrison, up the volume on the bossa nova right now. Yeah. Probably what I would like have to eat when I was in high school before going to morning workout or something. <laughs> <laughs> you 
know what we really need to do is like have like the comically large complete set. So it's just like every breakfast thing. So I'm cereal, check the camera. Uh, cereal, eggs, We're still cup, of, uh, cup of coffee, orange juice, like literally everything. <laughs> and then we only eat like two of the things. Yeah. We, we get the whole set, right? We get everything, like all of the cooking utensils and everything on no. there, and then we eat an apple. Yeah. <laughs> We make all like we make all these like like omelets and sausage patties or whatever and eat the apple. So how's your day been? You know it's been. Yeah? It has been. I uh drove it's normally a five hour trip, but I made it in four and a half hours from um uh from Kansas City. Yeah. Yeah. I was visiting a friend down there, making some connections, starting doing some modeling stuff, expanding my horizons. As far Why as... am I such a fucking slob? Oh. I'm like dripping milk down my face with every fucking bite I take. <laughs> Juicy. Like. I mean, I guess in some cultures it could be considered a compliment. My mouth is perspiration, that's the idea. <laughs> I don't like <laughs> I wonder if anyone's going to actually end up watching this. I am. I know that for <laughs> sure. I'll watch this like every morning as part of my breakfast routine. Boom! Cereal. Done. Jesus Christ! Told you you got too much of it. Well, it's like I haven't even like, finished one thing. <sighs> I just went hard on the cereal. <laughs> True, I've been like That's serving. all that I've done. I don't really particularly like orange juice either, so... But orange juice is good for you. It helps boost your immune system. No, it's not. I doubt anybody could have understood what I just said. <laughs> it helps boost your immune system. Yeah. I understood there's milk on my toast. <laughs> <laughs> there's just milk on this side of the half of the table. <laughs> I'm a slob. I'm not though. He's I'm a normally a very neat person. And don't you dare comment on my basement. I mean when it comes to actual oh, dirty yeah. things. Yeah. Clutter's different. You know? I've seen you eat. I know how you are. Clutter is different than clean than cleanliness. Okay? Yeah. Clutter is like You know, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's stuff without a home rather than like just straight garbage. Yeah. No, I gotcha, because that's like that's how exactly how my room is. Uncleanliness is like when you've got cheese just left on the counter for no goddamn reason. And then you make your the excuse that you're just letting it age. But it's like sliced American cheese. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, not even like like a block of cheese, like and the mold that's growing on it, you're trying to make the excuse I'm making blue cheese, but it's like white mold. Oh. Unsalted butter on toast. What thoughts? It's weird. Cause yeah, we're, we we usually like eat salted butter. Well, I think the main reason it's weird is because the toast is still slightly warm, but the butter's pretty damn cold. All right, that's done. So the butter's kind of like yeah chunked still. Taking a look at. We're still going. We're still going. Mark yeah, man. This is why, normally, we have a camera. Mm -hmm. Specifically for live action stuff. But our camera only records like eight minute intervals. And, and I yeah. was pretty certain this was gonna take longer than eight minutes. And Maybe. my phone will just keep recording. Yeah. It usually takes me longer than eight minutes to like eat like a complete meal. I don't know if I can do this. Really? There's too much. Are you a fucking apple? A full glass of orange juice and a full glass of milk. I'm about to walk all this time. Fuck you. 
I'm trying to improve my eating habits. So I don't get diabetes when I'm 45. Uh, I just convert this all into power and then work it off later. I mean, that's what I do too. Yeah, true. It's just I'm trying to eat less to produce the same amount of energy. And I think I can achieve that goal. They will get I also food. had a burrito like two hours ago. Oh, well, yeah. So. <laughs> I have eaten since like 11.30, so this is like my lunch and dinner right here. Well, I'm glad I could feed you. <laughs> take you long enough to take a bite out of that fucking apple? No, I'm gonna buy it. I wonder how disgusting this is to watch. <laughs> Just straight people eating. Probably pretty. This is a work of art right here. There's like a tiny ass gnat in here. I the moment when it's like the one from your basement. It's just haunting. No, I killed that fucking fly. Oh, you finally did? Yeah. Well, for those of you who don't watch the channel on a regular basis. Yeah. There was a fucking fly in my basement for the longest time. While we were recording, it would just fly right in my face or right in front of the screen. It was the fucking worst. And also, I sleep down there. And so whenever I'm trying whenever I was trying to go to bed, I'd be just about ready to fall asleep and then I just hear right by my ear and instinctively I'd go boom boom and then I'd be awake. <laughs> The fly is just sitting on the wall like any minute he's just gonna be about on the verge and I'll get him then one day in the morning I'm like half awake because I don't really sleep that well normally mm -hmm. and I'm just lying there trying to keep sleeping and all of a sudden and it lands on my face and I just smack myself as hard as I <laughs> fucking can <laughs> that fly has not been seen since. <laughs> That's like some Three Stooges shit. Just like fly landing on the nose, getting punched. And then I was like, I got it. I finished the toast. I know I keep checking on the video, but I'm real concerned that it's just gonna stop. It's still going. We should set up a mirror <laughs> so that I can just know. Oh. That'd yeah. be a smart idea. I mean, I mean, it's a little too late now. Just so you know, I don't have a tripod for my phone, uh, so it's literally being held up by painter's tape. On a box, on a chair. Yeah. Ah, orange juice. It's good. I only have sweet things left, other than milk and the egg. Oh you, God. You better get Get Here's cracking. the thing. I'm a vegetable guy. I will choose a fucking raw carrot any day of the week over a goddamn apple. Really? Because most people are opposite. I'm aware of that. I know that I'm the freak here. But I would much rather have a nice veggie plate with some fresh broccoli, fresh cauliflower, uh, baby carrots than a fruit platter with yogurt and fruit. I would hate that, because I'm not going to eat that. Back in uh, high school, uh, I would sit in my classes, and I often ate like lunch late or would be finishing my lunch often in those classes, and so I'd sit there and eat, and I eat peppers like whole, like straight pick them, eat them, and I have- Bell peppers. Yeah, bell peppers. Though I'm growing some, uh, some carol- Carolina Reapers and Ghost Peppers, well, that's just gonna be awesome to deal with. Um, you but, don't like spicy shit, why are you growing that? I don't know, because you can use it in cooking. Like, I like- I like To so make shit spicy! Yeah! You I'll, don't I'll, like spicy! I'll, What's I'll, the point? I'll, I can deal with spicy, it's just when it's like so spicy that, you know, I'm spending like 30 minutes hunched over. Then don't grow Carolina <laughs> Reapers and Ghost Peppers. That's the opposite well, you, of what you, you want. You use, you use very little of it. Here's the thing. 
they're hot throughout the whole pepper. Yeah. If you use a very little amount of it, that small amount, you're going to think, oh, okay, this is good. Then you're gonna hit the one bite that you actually put the damn thing on, and it's gonna be like, holy hell! I'll probably like use it in a marinade or something. But, um, no, so I'd sit there and just eat. I was just supposed to eat a fucking apple. Just like that, until you get to the core. My yeah. hands are juicy as shit, I hate it. This, my hands aren't like juicy or anything. Maybe my apple is better than yours. Yours is just juicier. Granted, I was like slurping this thing up like. Well seriously, I take a bite and it just goes. You're supposed to like inhale while you bite. So you get all the juice in. Eating your beard? Yeah. <laughs> I was to say, like, like there's at least footage of this somewhere of me pulling. Well, I think, I think it was, it was maybe it was. Did you cereal? eat the egg? Yeah, I ate the egg. How are you eating so fast? Cause I'm a vacuum. Granted, I'm nothing compared to you at uh, Poncheros, where you're just like, I was a bleeding. Well, it's cause you probably clipped it, uh, your gum. My gum is bleeding. Don't know if you can see that, but there's red right there on the apple. From my gum. See, this is why they call it the complete breakfast challenge, because it's dangerous. I don't think I know anyone else who's bled while eating an apple. <laughs> I'm sure it's more common than you think. The skin is rough. God, I hate this. Why did you choose Granny Smith then? Because it's the best fruit. I'm not. For me, I hate all fruit. What well, part of I don't like fruit? <laughs> Good, like chosen banana. I hate bananas. They're mushy and gross. <laughs> um, pineapple. Nope. Um, well, isn't tomato technically a fruit? I don't like fruit. tomatoes either. Um, <laughs> <laughs> or seriously, I order a salad and I move all the tomatoes from the salad to the side. What about pears? Nope. Don't like pears. I'm trying to think of like, like just like fruit that you can just like sit and eat without like having to like peel like like an orange. That's just a lot of work to. I hate oranges too. Finish your damn apple. Yeah, that's just the core that's left. There's some left there. Here's the thing, I can eat fast when it's food that I like. But when you have, yeah, exactly, when you have to actually but when I have to endure it. When I have to eat fruit, I'm like. See, most people are fruit people, people, like. I know, I'm, like, I'm that, that just baffles me because more people have, have a, a taste for the sweet, whereas vegetables are a little more. Give me a whole fucking carrot to finish it in three bites, but give me this apple and I'm like. Hey. I, I was just, I was a carnivore growing up. Well, yeah, I like meat too, but. Oh, I like, I like, I like exclusively liked meat. Like, like I could do like carrot, like raw carrots. I hate to cut car carrots, you know, and onions and all that, you know, all that kind of stuff. But, um. It, See, that's it, the thing. Cooked vegetables aren't good. No. And that's why I don't like fruit either, because they get mushy. So it's a texture thing. It's texture, yes. Okay. That's why apples are okay. Because the. But I don't like the flavor of fruit either, to be perfectly honest. But each fruit has a different flavor. I know. Well, this has been been a controversial episode. <laughs> you fruitist. The fruit whose flavor I can handle, I don't like the texture. Uh huh. And the fruit whose texture I can handle, I don't like the flavor. There's just no common ground for you, is there? I'm telling you. <laughs> it's a problem. I got a favorite goddamn apple. <laughs> she was like, yeah, that was, that was a, you know, get, get I finished out. my cereal, I finished my toast, and we had about the same left here. We had about the same left apple ones. We both still had our egg. You still had a piece of toast, even. Yeah. But then I just got to the apple, and I'm just done. Well, why don't you, like, eat the, well... I guess you don't want to save the worst for last. The last, you know, 
I think that's part of the reason why I always eat my sides. I'm bleeding all over this thing. <laughs> we need a medic. It's a massacre. <laughs> Just like cut it, like murder noises, like freaking like uh, psycho. <laughs> Stock sounds of. Woman screaming and shit. Look at this, there's just blood all over this fucking apple. You know, apples, it's just fighting back, dude. You gotta take it out. An apple would take you the doctor away my ass. <laughs> like, you just, you just gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta pain through it. Take down the enemy. Yeah. That good? Yeah, that's good. We all cool with that? That's, Sarah, that's, that's the apple. That's the core right there. Did I complain about that shit enough? So just for you're ready to stop rare. hearing me whine about eating fruit. I mean, you still have orange juice. I probably should have drank in the orange juice instead of the milk, cause that's gonna taste shitty after milk. Here well, we go. <laughs> just, just chug it. Just like, bam. Hold your nose. There you go. There you go. What a chance. The reason why that would taste shitty after milk is because it would taste like spoiled milk. Well, yeah, because you have that tang, like, aftertaste, then you're drink, drinking milk. Oh. And then I would eat the egg, then eat. I told you I was going to have a rough time finishing this. <laughs> See, this you is... check, make sure that we're still recording since I'm eating. Da, 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 da. We are indeed still recording. Good deal. Okay. I've got milk and an egg left, folks. It's been a long journey. But we've we've done it together. Ugh. Oh my god. <laughs> this is a real ordeal for you. It's not that much of an ordeal. This was an ordeal. The rest <laughs> of it's just like a bit difficult now. I'm feeling full. Well you just got you just got a little tiny egg. It's only waffle thin. How would anyone do this every fucking morning for breakfast? Easy, you just get up and make time for it. No, no, no. Physically. Oh, like eat all this every morning? Yeah. Like I could. Yeah, but you worked out every morning for like an hour and a half. Most people an don't half, fucking do that. Or hour and a half to do Most people don't fucking do that, Paul. <laughs> That's true. Most people wake up, eat breakfast, and go to work and sit on their asses for six hours. Then, if they're feeling like they have energy after work, they go work out. Yeah, see, I wake up, I, uh, I, what I usually do is I wake up, I work out for an hour and a half to two hours, um, and then I usually have breakfast after that because, I don't know, something about kickstarting your metabolism is better to go on an empty stomach. Plus, I don't want to go on a full stomach and just, like, throw up all everywhere. Um... And then stand all day in, in, at my day job and uh, build hydraulic parts. It's just an egg, man. It's just an egg. Hell, it's even in your, in your screen name and you're in your title. <laughs> you know that has nothing to do with actual I mean, eggs. yeah, I know. But still, you are the master. You got this. Yeah, it didn't occur to me until like recently how much my name, Metro Egg Gaming, and my, my tag, Eggy, makes it seem like I love eggs and they're my favorite food. They're not. <laughs> not. I don't dislike eggs, but they're like... It's a Yoshi thing. Right? Yeah, it's about Yoshi. Yeah. It's not about, it's not about at eggs. It's about, I named... Actually, I don't even remember why the fuck I came up with the name Eggy. I was playing... So here's a story. Yeah, these are nicely boiled. Yeah. So here's a story. Um, back when I was in like elementary, early middle school, mm -hmm. I would go over to my cousin's house all the time. Dylan, go subscribe to Dylan is Dense if you're watching this video. Uh, his his house. And him and his stepbrother. I, we would uh, play Smash Bros all the time. Mm -hmm. Smash Bros Melee was what was out at the time. And uh, I played Pichu, Red Bandana Pichu. Yeah. And for some reason, I, I decided to name, you could only have four letters for a tag in that game. Yeah. 
Uh, and so I, I just made it eggy. I don't know why, I don't know where it came from. I probably knew at the time, but at this point I do not remember. I think it's because maybe I started as plain, plain as Yoshi, I don't know. Maybe, uh, that, that would make sense. But ever since then, Eggie's kind of been my yeah. smash name. Obviously my smash name is my initials, because... And since Smash is my favorite game of all time, no. it became part of my channel name too. And the Metro, for those of you who don't know, is because my other username for everything is Metrophiliosis. Does that mean something, or did you just make nope. it up? Okay. Because, <laughs> like, for the longest time, you know, as long as I've known you, I, I never questioned Metrophiliosis, and then until, like, I don't know, maybe a month ago, I'm like, hmm, Metrophiliosis, is that a thing? I feel like that, that, that could possibly be something. It like, means absolutely nothing. Like some disease, like right. It sounds like it sounds like some kind of like fear of metropolitan areas or something. <laughs> I, I, I can't, I can't go downtown. Why not? I have metrophiliosis. <laughs> Anyways, the skyscrapers are too big. There's too I came many. up with it because it worked phonetically, and yeah. I liked the way it sounded. <laughs> M e t r o p h i l i o s i s. I love that, but, uh, did I spell that right? I uh, whatever, yeah. Oh, hey. Yeah, that was... <laughs> Hi, kitty. We, we did it. Oh. This is, it's kitty. It's, it's, we did it. It's kitty. We did it, kitty. We did it. Yay. Kitty, yay. Yay. I'm kitty. Give me a ride. We did it. We beat challenge. We ate all the food. Yeah. It was easier for some of us than others. Some of us got Even hurt. Even though he poured himself more cereal than me. I'm, I'm just an endless abyss of a black hole. I cut my gum. There were casualties. But I finished the goddamn apple more or less. They will be missed. And that was the challenge. So. Yeah, we did it. Okay, uh, <laughs> insert generic uh, uh, How I Met Your Mother meme right here. Woo! Yeah. Boom, it goes away. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> what was with the How I Met Your Mother reference? Challenge completed? Oh, okay, yeah. Challenge. It's an obligatory How I Met Your Mother reference. Yeah, okay, I gotcha, I gotcha. So, uh... I know that we're probably not the first people to do this, and that's <coughs> probably other people have already submitted videos of this, but hey, we're the first on our channel to do it. Yeah. <coughs> so, uh, Brett and Santel over at Super Couch Fighters, we hope that you watched this video and enjoyed us being idiots, and Kitty says hi, there's a thunderstorm, so she's scared. Um, but, uh, also, I wanted to say, uh, if you are the Super Catch Fighters and you're watching this video, I've admired your work for a very long time, and, um, we play a lot of fighting games on our channel. Yeah. Uh, uh, we even did a recent series where, we're even working on a series currently where I'm trying to help Colin here learn some of the ins and outs of fighting games. I suck! And so, uh, <laughs> if you guys would be interested in doing a collaboration at any point, it would be amazing. That would be... That would mean the world to us. It would be awesome. And if not, I understand that you guys got busy schedules. I hope you just had fun watching this video. And if you're not the Super Couch Fighters and you're watching this video, then hey, I hope you just had fun watching us be idiots eating cereal and breakfast foods and uh, cutting my lip open. <laughs> but uh, yeah, Colin's got a corp. So uh, please like, comment, and subscribe this video, and we'll see you later. Isn't that right, kitty? That's right. That's right. Good girl. Be scared because there's a thunderstorm. Okay. Bye. See you later, guys. Never stop the video. <laughs>